Just giving you an, just See, inviting my friend to go have a free place to stay. No, I appreciate somewhere. it, dude. It's fine that you don't want to make the time for me. It's cool. I understand. It's cool. Look, I brought you saying I know, you're, I know that you've like blown up now. Your shoe reviews have blown up. Everybody needs me to change the name of the channel. You know? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, it's cool. Don't, you know, you probably got too much live streaming to do. You can't fucking. <laughs> I got Comcast coming. Because if I can get my live stream just a little less grainy, I really think I can get the crystals on my weed there a little better. Look, but I got these burritos is where I'm going with this. We've been trying to try these. Let me tell you, this place was popping, dude. Walked in, there's a line of like 30 people. We got to take it to the dog park. It's the best burrito in the fucking state. It's a the best burrito. handheld breakfast burrito, and then they have the best smothered back breakfast burrito. A little mushy. A little mushy. Of course, who taught you how to eat a burrito? I draw it myself. You unroll a burrito. Like this? <laughs> I hate you so much sometimes. <laughs> See, that was a troll. You know what I was talking about. Speaking of, you're gonna be in a troll. <laughs> XXX, have you heard the new EP? No. Remember my Kendrick claim? Uh huh. He's not there yet. <laughs> yeah. But also there's... saw that he's a YouTube gamer now. So I mean, is he? Yeah. He's gonna be giving life advice on it. Here's some life advice. Don't stick a knife in your girlfriend. You liar. I'm not saying. Are you anything. saying that I'm making that part? This isn't for the vlog. But are you saying I'm a liar? Are you right. saying that you didn't no. act like that? No, I'm not saying anything, and I don't believe that anything's not for the vlog. I just, I gotta figure it out. Believe me, I want to. You think I don't want to just go to the mountains and fucking snowboard? For it's just the. You missed it. Yeah, yeah, I did it. I did. I did. Yeah. Go ahead and help. Yeah. About it. He took my blunt. I just rolled this a nice blunt of Gorilla Glue. I brought over some breakfast, some some nice <laughs> Santiago's burritos. <laughs> oh, breakfast I there. I threw in two nice monsters, and my man throws the blunt off the deck. He just, two hits and literally, I wish we had the camera, throws the blood. It's down there. I don't know where. The guy who owns this parking lot here hates us. We're gonna be looking at that dude's parking lot. Look, yeah. He's gonna come out and then I'm gonna fight him and then we're gonna be, the police are gonna get called. Today's gonna be sick. TGIF. But that blunt was straight trash. You knew it was trash. You know how I know you knew it was trash? It's cause you handed it to me and you looked away. And you kind of like went like this, like turned your back when I hit it. And I, I was just like, hoping you'd be in your phone and not notice. It's inconsistent. Sometimes it's great. Why? I don't know, dude. It's like everything else I do. Sometimes that's, that's I, not good. You need to be consistent. You know? <laughs> well, there's some things I'm consistently Humans good with. Cons consistently, but other things, consistent. like PUBG, for example, I'll get in. Sometimes I'll have two, three good games, really good. You and don't have two or three good games. Okay, one or two. No, that's one. The, no, that's not what happens. You play PUBG and you have a good. Few Few minutes of a game, Few minutes. and then by the end of the game, you're just all over the place. Exactly. I think most people would classify this as ADD. Um, here's my problem with the blunt rolling, because I'm not a fucking asshole. Here's the thing. These Dutch Masters, Cost we have to go out of our way to go get. <laughs> we have to, we get four or five at a time. It costs me fucking $40 or yes. some shit. Like and then you thing. roll them. And then we spend the money on the weed. Like, it's good weed. We spend a bunch of money on weed. <laughs> just and then you, grab. yeah, threw it out because I'm sick of this shit. And then you roll it like an asshole. Like, you won't just take the time. And here's my problem. Here's my real problem. And I know that this isn't your reality anymore, but if you were on a first date with a chick, like if this was your first date with a chick, I know I'm not a chick and we're not on a first date, but if you were. I like your fit though. Thanks. Man. If you were, this isn't really my fit, I just threw it on. Um, oh. You would try to roll the most perfect blunt. You'd be like, oh, I'm gonna roll this, I roll blunts, girl. Yo, girl, I, I do this. You know, I'm from fucking Queens, dog. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> we roll that pith. So, I roll the shitty blunts so, of Snoop Dogg. So, I know, but this is true. That is a good point. But anyway, I feel like there are moments in your life where you would roll a good blunt to prove yourself. And around me, you just don't give a fuck. And I know that I feel like I can just shame you into fucking correcting it's your just behavior. The honeymoon period's over and I've given up on it. <laughs> yeah. Just I'm just trying to get blunts. you to like, I just don't like starting my, like if you start your day off with a bad blunt, how's the rest of your day gonna go? Omar, what do you think? Omar's like taking you to the dog park. Y'all are fucking crazy. Is there a difference between mine and yours? The difference is that yours is up here on the 11th floor, and mine <laughs> is out there. Subway. Please stop asking for me to get my own vlog. You're not gonna, and you're gonna get me blurred out of this one. <laughs> so, don't put that in the comments tonight if you want to see my face any longer. My big man! I told you the story yeah. like an hour you ago. You and Brandy have this thing of this, I told you this before. That you yeah, it's a conspiracy. We, it's we made it up. What's your number? 845. Oh, I'm not so nervous to get on the other. Oh, no. 
Tales of Poop shut down rail yard dog park in Denver. This was uh, eight days ago. It doesn't say if it's reopened yet. And there's no number to call. No, it's like I'll just take him to the baseball field. I don't want to waste time. Yeah, I don't need to. Walmart. Fucking rebel. Go. Sorry, Roland, I think. <laughs> oh! <laughs> he still got it. Jeez. We have an injury on the field. All right, I mean, he's just fucking. <laughs> waiting with the vlog camera and. This lady, this girl comes out, she's like, who's in there? What? She's like, who's in there? And I'm like, uh, my friend Sean. Oh, my Lord, what does he do? He's a tattooer? Yeah, can I? Oh, she's like, I thought you were a paparazzi. And I was like, no. I'll tell you, your butt was so big, it, it would have sucked, but I was so tempted when you handed it to me to just throw it off the roof. I thought it would have been amazing. <laughs> Clear. When I threw weed off the roof today, it was my weed. Yeah. You just rolled it up. So it's like I was still throwing away my weed. You threw away my weed long before I physically threw it when you rolled that trash ass blunt and presented it to me. Oh my god. And you can't even use that in your track. Do it yourself because I did. That's when my response track. I did it myself. Ernie's nervous. Palms are sweaty. Mom's spaghetti. Oh, <laughs> playing for, like... We've been playing for four months. You've maybe <laughs> killed 10 people. Maybe. <laughs> Definitely not 20. Dude, I've killed 20. Definitely not I've, 20. I've had at least five or six games where I've killed two. So that's 12 right there. Yeah, okay. So you're still not 20. Then, okay, let's just say, let's just for the sake of argument, say you've had 20 kills over four months. Yeah, that's a kill a week. <laughs> <laughs> Yesterday you didn't even shoot your gun. Dude, I'm not a violent person. <laughs> I really like this place. Yeah. The whole aesthetic. I have a couple of New York strips. Whoa. All of us. Mistakes. And there's something going on. Yeah. Operator error. So we lost. Oh, it's not a fucking operator. We lost. Operator. Can't we, this this is battery. Bullshit. This battery's fully. But we couldn't record ourselves really in the meat market or on the way home because our batteries were dead. But now the battery works. We're not gonna argue about it, Ern, because I'm forgiving. It's fine. No, yeah. it's no big deal, man. No, it wasn't. Don't let it bother you. There's obviously an issue. Don't let, don't let it bother you, man. Just shake it off. It's cool. It's cool. There's never, obviously... I'm never upset. Never upset with you, dog. Oven. I've done this before on the channel. It was a long time ago I cooked a steak. We have a lot more people here now. How I cook steak is I let it sit out for 30 minutes or whatever. I think they call it roasting it, but I just put it in the oven at 200 degrees for 20 minutes. That's what I do first. So 200 degrees, 20 minutes. Set a timer for 10 minutes. That's not even true, that's a lie. What I do is I set a timer for 12 minutes. When that timer goes off, it gives me eight minutes to warm up my pan before my work begins, before the magic happens. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna cook you a steak. Nice. Cause I love you. I don't know, oh, it's from the mystery. It was from the mystery thing. Why, it's like eight weeks <laughs> yeah. one. It's like, I'm like indica sativa. I don't know what the fuck is hitting me. You're getting Holy punched, shit. you're getting fucking boom, 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 boom. Yeah. When these little piles happen, I put them in here, and then we have this. That's what we smoke. The bubonic is what I call it. <laughs> yeah. Worn two out of three of my Kith Columbia jackets today. For those of you asking where these came from, it's Kith Columbia. They are no longer available. I, um, I'm going snowboarding this weekend, it sounds like. Maybe even Monday too. Ern hasn't made up his mind of it yet because he has so I got much. Some shit he's got so much to do. He has so much to do. I have to get started on a painting because there's an art show at the tattoo shop on Saturday. To finish stuff for this. Uh, the next you are your enemy drops. You're scared. This I think you're scared. scared. I think you saw yourself on film. I think you saw Blazendary snowboard vlog and now you're just feeling a little different. No, no. I think that's what happened. Ba -ba -da -boom. When are hats coming? The people want to know. They're in production. That's what I said. Now that's got to sit for at least seven minutes.
What? We're gonna play Fortnite. Everybody wants us to play it. Might have gotten a little overcooked. No. Not rare, but medium rare. I don't care. Cooked? Did the roast thing begin? Nah, it's not that overcooked. Yeah. It's medium rare. It's like just a perfect medium rare. That shit banging. No, there may not be a lot of places to get sushi out here in Colorado, but. I like how, in case anybody wanted to ever steal it or anything. Snowboard. Snowboard. Um, so we tried to play Fortnite. We gave it a shot. Nice. Aaron got a kill. Oh. This is the best game I've ever played. <laughs> You're a shit. fucking asshole. Uh, On this town. Give me that Never again. You just said you thought it was the best game. Oh yeah, well I got a kill. I actually didn't mind it. It's just a lot. I do like PUBG just a lot. Mark's not even going after it. He's over it. Oh. Nice. Tight. Nice. 158 wide, baby. What's, where's my other board? Actually, first snowboard ever that I bought. As this snowboard is a hand-me-down from when I knew you and I left New York and I came out here and I was all broke as fuck. My homeboy gave me this board because it was his like two-year-old board. And so I've been riding on that since then. And that was like six years ago or something, five, six years ago. Yeah. Yeah, so. Couldn't even afford one, dog. So yeah, mine, this is a 156. This is a 158. First snowboard. The snowboard. I don't have a screwdriver. I can't find it. So I'll just switch it in a minute. Nice. Height, man. New snowboard. So I'm going snowboarding this weekend. For sure. For sure. Okay, so uh, it's, uh, it's Friday and we have drop on Sunday, which are these shirts. These released in mystery bags. We sent out some uh, before they came out. These will come out on Sunday in t-shirts, long sleeve, uh, long tees and hoodies. The sizing is on the site now, so you can just check sizing and measurement. So hoodies are a little bit longer than our previous hoodies. If you got a Kong hoodie, it's the same, but they are longer than previous hoodies. I love the new hoodie, like probably one of my favorites. That's why I, all week I've been wearing the Kong hoodie. So super into that. But yeah, new drop on Sunday, 10 a.m. for the Panthers. All the Panther orders come with a print and this sort of manifesto that I wrote that goes with it. So if you want to cop, 10 a.m. This week, a lot of work is being done towards just kind of like furthering things along. As people know, I've been trying to make higher quality items like pants and hats and socks and, you know, just kind of bringing everything up. So a lot of busy work this week doing stuff like that. There's a lot of wheels in motion, a lot of, a lot of stuff going on. But yeah, trying to get that all nailed down this week probably next week as well it's just gonna be uh, just uh, some cool stuff happening and just takes a lot of work um, speaking of which the tattoo shop that I work at tank south where the vlog started um, which I'm gonna be back in more regularly here soon we're having an art show there on Saturday this coming up Saturday so I'm gonna be there for a little bit I'm gonna come and hang out and I'm also gonna put in a piece of art I've told you guys I have this plan to paint all this stuff this year and I was gonna start with a really big painting but I guess this would be a nice warm-up is to start with something a little bit smaller just something to put in the art show and I only have really a week to do it so it can't be too crazy but if you're around Denver area Littleton if you want to come to the shop address in my description is where the party will be that's where the shop is so if you'd like to come to that party it's open to it's open to everyone so definitely come out and check it out uh, paintings will be for sale there be food drinks you know Sager likes to do it up so I'm sure it'll be a good time uh, if you want to check out more details they're on they're on the thing tank south instagram but i'll be there next saturday um, and there is an art show but because of all that all that information is pertinent because one this box my paint's still not here it hasn't shipped yet but i can start doing some other stuff before it gets here hopefully it gets here soon these are markers the markers i draw with are tombos i usually draw with markers and not pencils sometimes i draw with pencils but usually markers really i'll draw with anything that makes a mark i really don't care but i prefer these markers and years ago, I bought this full set, and at the time, 
I had told my girlfriend to not touch them. I was like, I just want these markers for myself. I'm pretty good at sharing, but still at this time, I was like, just want the full set to stay intact. So this time I have the full set again. I'm gonna set it up over here. And if any of them end up missing, I can only really blame myself. Look at that. Beautiful. Just makes you want to draw. You know what I'm saying? Woo! It even comes with like a little stand. I remember this. So I basically will be, I'll be spending the rest of the evening doodling, sketching, trying to come up with an idea. I don't really, uh, like I said the other day, I don't really know what I'm gonna do or what my ideas are when I sit down to doodle. So, um, or draw for a huge project or whatever. So I'm just gonna sit here and draw for a little and get some of that started so I have somewhat of an idea what to paint and get on paper and then this week we'll be able to paint some so but yeah that's pretty much the day i'm gonna do that edit the vlog it's friday so we will not see you this weekend probably gonna go snowboarding um so i'll probably film my snowboard trip i don't know if Ern's coming or not i might even stay up to in the mountains until monday so we'll see if there's a late upload on monday that's why uh drop sunday as i said 10 a.m trying to think anything else anything else I don't think so. All right, cool. Uh, you guys have a good weekend. Peace.